The timing of follow-up after the discontinuation of phototherapy should be based on the risk of rebound. Except in specific circumstances, at least 12 hours should be given, so you don't want to repeat it very soon unless there is a risk factor. And preferably 24 hours should elapse to allow sufficient time for the redistribution to happen and to demonstrate whether there is rebound or at least a risk of rebound because as he said it can continue increasing for next 2-3 days as well. And that one measurement at the clinic level may not be enough if you see an increasing trend but it is below the treatment level you may need to bring them back at 24 hour intervals to the clinic. So it's very important to have a clear system of follow up in the clinic having an arrangement where the parents don't have to wait long where they don't need to mingle with other patients with infectious disease for example. So you need to plan your uh, stream in the outpatient clinic to suit these babies. And remember most of these mothers are really tired, they are having a new baby who is just learning to feed, sleepless nights, so you have to be really considerate in the way we plan the follow up. It's an option to measure the transcutaneous bilirubin instead of TSB if it has been at least 24 hours since the phototherapy was stopped. Uh, I mentioned earlier about the use of the patch during phototherapy, so that is more uh, inconclusive, but this is definitely easier. So if the bilirubin is not that high, you can avoid the blood test at that stage. And infants who exceeded the phototherapy threshold during the birth hospitalization and received phototherapy before 48 hours had a positive DAT or had known or suspected hemolytic disease and also the baby is less than 38 weeks gestation should have the TSB measured 6 to 12 hours after phototherapy discontinuation. So it is this group of babies where we would keep them for a few more hours after stopping phototherapy before we discharge and then depending on the rate of increase you can decide the next follow up.